In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up all of the mobile devices in your home with SmartThings and set them up as presence sensors. Coming up next. Hi, this is Justin from Simply Smart, where we make smart home technology as easy as one, two, three. So if you're interested in smart home technology, consider subscribing for more content like this. Now in this video, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this old iPhone 4 here and we're gonna change this into a smart presence sensor in our smart things. And we will be doing this using the classic app. Now, if you do have the new app and you wanna follow along, just go ahead and download the classic app. You can have both running at the same time. Um, and then once you set this up, it'll show in the new app as well. So what you want to do is the, the new person that's going to be setting this up, they're going to have to create their own Samsung account. They're going to have to download the Samsung app and then click New to SmartThings. All right, and since we don't have an account, we're going to have to go down to the bottom here and click Create Account. And you're just going to have to agree to the terms and services. All right, and once you get to this page, you're going to type in an email and a password. And you'll need to fill in all of the information it's asking for, first name, last name. And at the bottom, you just need to prove that you're not a robot. And once you've verified that, just hit the next button. And now it says the last steps to create your account is go to your email and verify your account. All right, so we just go into our inbox and verify our account. All right, and it says that our Samsung account has been verified. And now what we need to do is go on to our account that we set up our hub with, which is the primary account that is linked to the home, and send an in invitation to this old phone here. Okay, so now we're on our primary account um, that set up the SmartThings in the first place, and we just need to go into our SmartThings app and you when you come in you're going to want to go to the more tab at the bottom and then you want to go to manage users once in here you can just hit add user and type in the email of the new user and send an invitation and then at the top of their screen you can see that the invitation has been sent now over on our old phone we see that we have an email here a SmartThings user has shared their location with you. So all we need to do is go down a little bit and click on Accept Invitation. And now it's going to ask you to log in with your Samsung account. So we're going to have to tap that. All right, now on this page, we just need to enter our login credentials. So we'll go ahead and do that real quick. Now that we have all of our login information, entered we just need to click sign in and you're all set so now it says you're all set you can start using smart things app to control devices in um, our house at the home location now if we go back over to our smart things account and we log in and once you're logged in um, you just need to hit continue and then once you're logged in you should see basically um, your smart things on their phone and when you go over to the my home tab you'll have basically everything as it is in your app um, now i've already made a video on how to set up the presence sensor so i will leave a link to that in the video description everyone that has a phone in your house you can easily have them install the smart things app create an account send them an invitation have them accept the invitation and then from there set up the presence sensor on each of those phones. And that is basically all there is to it. If you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comment section. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video.